What's going on guys? I'm going to show you how to repair some poly pipe today. Right there it's just two emitters that are missing. Um, I had a bunch of bushes here. They all got ripped out. So we're just going to repair that with a coupler. As you come down here you see our new floodgation. They decided this area needs a lot more water apparently. No, nah, just kidding. So, um, same thing. We had some bushes here. They were tore out for whatever reason. So, you can see we had some emitters right there. We got a break right here. I'm going to show you guys how to repair this. Alright. So. What you guys will need to repair poly. Or install it regardless. Need some poly cutters. Some crimps and some pinch clamps. Now, we got a break right here. All the way farther back over here is where we're missing the emitters. I don't know if you can see it on camera. So, we're gonna cut well past that. We're gonna cut right here. We wanna get a clean cut. Keep it rotating. Nice clean cut. We're gonna go, we're gonna go past the emitters where the emitters used to be so right here we're gonna cut it there Hope the view's okay guys I gotta get a better way of doing this nice clean cut now what we need is let's see I'm gonna try to turn it What we need is a length of pipe between these two. Hmm. Roughly about the size of my arm. We got some extra pipe. Right there, right there. There we go. When you use the cutters, make sure you turn them. Get a nice even cut. Insert kind of coupling like that. Boom, boom. Look beautiful. Here's how I keep my pinch clamps. It's a nice way to do it. Always use two on each side of the fitting. One, two. Jam our fitting in there. Now this hose has been sitting in the sun, or this poly pipe has been sitting in the sun, so it's nice and flexible which is always helpful this is three quarter inch <clears throat> this one has not been sitting in the sun so you can see it's a little tougher <sighs> okay now you want to offset the pinch clamp I'll pinch it and then I'll show you guys <clears throat> there's one there's two See how it's offset. Okay. That way your punch points are just kind of different places. Alright. And then we'll do the same thing on the other side. a little long, which is okay. Better too long than too short. So let's get a cut. Same thing, two here. Hope you guys can see this all right. Two here. Get our insert fitting in. Jamila said it wouldn't be that long. Yeah. Also, 
was like two fifteen to three fifteen. I'll pay for that one. When you guys do pinch I'm trying to get a good camera angle for you guys. Really should use a tripod. Much easier. When you guys do these punch clamps, you want one not all the way, not right at the top, but just a little bit below. You want to see a little bit of the poly pipe coming off the top. So we're gonna pinch one, and like I said, we offset it. So let's pinch the second one. That way the pinch points are offset, one's on the top, one's on the back. Same thing, not all the way to the top. Pinch it, come back. Pinch it again. Beautiful. And then we'll bury it. And that's how you repair some poly.